Hey folks, welcome back to Stranded Alien Dawn. We've got, uh, we're still sitting pretty much that same night, the same, you know, same time as we ended last episode. Edmund's just getting to bed. Our dog has found his sleeping mat and sound asleep. We've got Kana over here. We're kind of waiting to see if we do snag a lightning bolt this storm now that we're connected to the electric grid. He, that's right, Edmund was getting this last pole put in. So now we're, we're connected completely. Uh, Kiki's grandma brought up a point about Kana being a vegetarian. And, you know, we've got, the, of course, the veggie meals. Are we still in view? Yeah. Where's the other one? Right there and right there. I want to keep these in my view. Uh, we've got the veggie soups, which are high enough up that she'll always have a meal. But she might not have a lot of variety. I'm assuming the buttermelon pie is considered a non-meat. If that, and vegetarian, so I think that is another one. But I'm wondering if Kana... I'm running, right? Yeah. Sounds like the storm is calming down. If Kana can eat the raw foods that were giving everybody else negatives, I wonder if we told her she could eat the raw vegetables if it would give her a bonus since she's a vegetarian. Don't know if the game has thought that far ahead or not, so we'll... We'll enable that as well and experiment with that. Um, otherwise, the rain has ended, which means we have another lightning bolt coming in, right? Uh, ten seconds after. Three, two, one. Nothing? <laughs> the last couple of storms gave us a show. Apparently not. Okay. We're still running. Yeah, four in the morning. Okay. Well, so much for that. While we are running, I've been thinking long and hard about our refrigerator way over here instead of over here next to the kitchen. What I'm thinking about, and we were playing with the idea of sticking one more shelter out here without it looking bad, and I think I figured out how to do that. If I were to copy you and put you in right about here, does that make that go away? Yeah. If I do that. That gives us three spaces, which is what we need for this big old refrigerator, which really doesn't hold a lot of food to begin with. But if this were to move over to here, then we could put it in these three spaces. It'd be a stove, fridge, stove, lost harvest. Is that our harvest? I think it's harvest way out over there, and that's fine. In fact, I should undo that just to get it out of our... Uh, let's... Double click you and cancel orders. Okay. Risk of meltdown, Edmund. Oh, he's probably starving. He didn't get much sleep. Though he's up early. He's not triggered to get up until 7, but he sleeps faster than most. Edmund, stats, yeah, his rest is good. His happiness is the problem, and he's fig fixing that right now with his pumpkin pie. So he's heading all the way up to there. But Simon is getting up to research. Let's calm everybody down a little bit here. I want somebody. Uh, well, you're petting the dog. I can't refuse that. Simon, let's give you a job. Can you put this guy over here? So I can move the refrigerator and then re, uh, reconfigure the power. I think it would work better. I think it would be a little more efficient. And we have this space to do something else in. What? I don't know. And then, Edmund, are you done officially? You says you still are. Are you walking over here to call him over? Oh, so we are getting a little bit of interaction this time. Okay. All right, you do that. Um, notes. We got a message last time about a signal flare. Expeditions signal rocket which sounds like a survivor in that I doubt an automated distress signal would go out as a signal rocket. It would take a human to pull that trigger. So we possibly have a seventh character out there. Um, next, and explore. Okay. So we want to send Edmund out on that as soon as he's done petting and as soon as he... Yeah, the petting must count as relaxation. So I think... Is that 48 going up? Yeah. So once he's done with that, I think we can send him out and he'll be good. And that last time we sent him out, he walked all the way back in, 
stopped here and then left. Two of the, I, I've watched that closely. Two of the grain porridges disappeared. So he grabbed two meals to take with him. One for him and one for whoever he was picking up, I assume. So he'll probably do that again. Um, so we've got potentially a seventh person, which means we need a seventh bed. And I was scratching my head trying to figure out how to deal with getting another bed squeezed in here somewhere. And I got to thinking that, you know, we've got two perfectly good bedrooms sitting right over here now. We just have to get this roof done. So Carter, well, Carter, once you get done with all of this, you need to build a roof. And it kind of needs to be done today. Yeah. Hmm. So Carter right now is sitting. Sitting couldn't possibly be that exciting. Let's give you something that's more exciting. Um, why don't you dartboard? Oh, that generator, that's the noise. So I think, I would guess the darts would give you a higher boost than sitting. But um, through my notes here, things to get done today. I went out and checked out that wood that we left way out there and it's gone. I searched and searched. I never saw anybody walk out there, there to get it. And it does take a long time to degrade. So I don't know what happened there. It's gone. The hay is still here. So we've got to go collect this and there's quite a bit like so and you've got 180 of it so that's more than edward could carry by himself carter is one level higher in physical he's five edward is four so i wonder if carter can handle 180 instead of 140 that might be worth finding out though carter's going to be busy but in the process of looking for that wood i found something that i didn't expect to find so i went looking around i found some over here too something new with the update but those little yellow dots down there right there manure we've got manure I know it's a byproduct of these guys they make their manure producers we don't know what manure does yet so I'm wondering what is our closest manure to our area nothing over here looking for yellow dots in the grass there's something right there manure observe We'll send Simon to do that. In fact, we could do that now, right? Now, he's probably doing his... Uh, where am I? Doing his uh, Simon... Actually, your relaxation is fine. Where are you at the moment? You are playing a handpan. Yeah, you're fine. So, why don't you come over and grab a meal, eat some veggie soup, and then head out here and observe some manure so we can find out what that is today. And oh, finding you cold, that's not going to be easy, is it? Yeah, oh wait, right there? There you are. Nope, you won't right click on it. That's not. Okay, let's do it this way. No. No. Okay, where was I? That should be lit up. There you are. Okay, Simon. When you're done eating, come on out here, shift, and observe that. Okay, you've got eating, and then you've got observe as you're cued. Perfect. Paul, what you up to? You're going to take a break. That's fine. I want somebody, though, to move that refrigerator. Um, Carter, when you're done playing darts, you're going to move the refrigerator. I haven't even set it in motion yet. Okay, move. I want you to be over... Oh, can't do it. Oh, this refrigerator is a pain in the backside. Can I do it here? I can do it there. And you can still get in to the stove, apparently. It didn't say I couldn't. Okay. Yeah, I'll work with that. So that gets that over there. And then we'll move power poles after that. Okay. So Carter's going to get that moved... And then I assume he's going to get to work on building brick walls. Do that. Do that. Do that. Okay. Carter is all queued up. Paulette was just going to be Paulette. Rita, what are you up to today? You and Connor are both eating. Hopefully having happy conversations in there. 
Uh, Rita is pretty much set back for farming, planting, harvesting, what have you. So I see we've got some of our heptagonias ready to harvest. We've got our silicone to harvest. We've got our leather to harvest. And we can turn this guy off so she doesn't have to walk out there and do that. These should be ready pretty soon, right? 94%. Yeah. Okay. So Edmund is going to be leaving soon. I'd set him to do it right now, but I don't know if it would override this. Let's kind of watch this. This is our, our new feature for the game. It looks pretty good, doesn't it? Yep. Okay. You're repairing a fence. And as much as I would love to let you do that and skill up your construction, I need you... Can I right-click on that? I can't. Let's do it this way. Expeditions, signal rocket, send Edmund, and uh, send expedition. Okay, escape out of that. We should see him path over, grab a meal. We'll watch it this time, see what he takes off the shelf. And you're going to be off and doing your thing. Kana could very well repair these things. Uh, insufficient skill to repair brick fence. Okay. Can you repair the wooden fence? Insufficient skill. So you can't do any fence repairing. Darn, you can't do any fence building. Okay, we're going to have to get you skilled up in other ways. Okay, so that's not going to happen. Um... I have not named the dog, and last episode where the dog was discovered, or tamed, only just went out a few minutes ago. I've been gone for a couple of days, so I don't want to deal with that this episode. I'll wait to see if there's any interesting comments that come in first. What's all the red out here? These are the blueberry bushes. Oh, wow. It's autumn. There's no harvest left. Ooh, we hit the end of the blueberry season, didn't we? Mm-hmm. Yeah. If there's going to be any more of these brought in this season, it's kind of got to be right now, huh? Like, right now. Uh, let's grab berry fruit bushes. Let's harvest the few that are left. Rita... You are currently harvesting our own crops. Come on out here and harvest these three immediately. And then harvest these. And hunt hummingbee, humming fly. No, harvest those and harvest that one. And then that's pretty much the end of that crop for, for a while. Yeah. Okay, well, we'll get out of there what you can. Um, so things are happening. Oh, did we not? Edmund, where are you? We did not. Didn't get to see what he took. Oh, well, there'll be another time. Ah, uh, you're taking off. Kana is transporting meats. Okay. Oh, that's right. We had that fiasco with the, uh, with the barrel last time. Uh, Paulette, can you get the fuel going? Thank you. <laughs> that was funny. I couldn't get them to do it no matter what I did. <laughs> You're fighting each other. Okay, Carter is constructing fences. Good. And Rita is on her way out there. Rita, you're in great shape. Simon, you are out here absorbing this. And your happiness drop. Oh, I wish that you were interested in research. You're so good at it. I wish you got a bonus out of it. Um, Paulette is getting something to eat. So she missed her meal time to do all these other things. And Kana, you are doing all the transporting and delivering and what have you. Um, you could move this, couldn't you? You could. That's a that is a construction. You got your plus eighteen there and a little bit more uh, um, skills. Good. Does it show Kana skills construction zero? Oh, for next level. So you are exactly a one. And haven't built a thing since you've been here. Is that what I'm getting? For that to be at exactly zero? Yeah, those sort of things, even though it's construction, she got her bonus, it doesn't count as a skill. 
Okay. Uh, you... We moved you there to be able to handle the... To be able to snag this. So it doesn't matter where you landed. Okay. So power pole. Move. I need to grab that in a place that's convenient. Which is probably either there or there because it doesn't block a pathway. Could be here, but that means they got to walk two spaces around to get around that. Getting kind of crowded around here, but... Yeah, that works. Okay. Two unpowered devices. Kana, are you capable of building a power pole? Oh, did I hit move? Oh, I didn't mean to hit move. Cancel. Nope. Cancel. <laughs> Let's try building copy. Okay, just just ignore the last 15 minutes of this, this video. Okay, all the mysteries are gone. Kana, can you build that? You can. You're doing right now. You're transporting. Why don't you do that? Give you something fun to do. Okay. That was that was painful. Oh, our leather is being dried. Good. Or hides. Okay. Oh, and we're ready for more uh, bricks to be made. Okay, things are happening. Carter's repairing the fence, which means he's going to go find some more brick. And he's got a few more of these to build, so he's going to be done here in a little bit. You get the repairing all done. Hopefully you got enough brick to repair all of them. Hopefully you queued that up. We discovered manure! Now, is this for cooking or what? For crafting of liquid fuel on the workbench. Okay, that's different. Upon extensive observation of the object... <laughs> what is that thing? It's like a big brown pizza. Hmm. Upon extensive observation of the object, I concluded that this is indeed the byproduct of common metabolo metabo yeah, metabolic systems known on many worlds as manure. I think it's poo. However, this one seems to be secreting small amounts of flammable liquid. Mmm, that could be collected and used as fuel. It could be used as fertilizer as well. I don't remember there being a fertilizer in the game before. Interesting. Okay, good discovery. And another reason to go get some, some olfen. And build yourself a pasture. Mm-hmm. Uh, Simon, while you're there, let's collect it. Right there. Uh, double click. 40 manure. Let's use. Survivors are forbidden to carry or use this item. No, let's go ahead. Can I get you to collect it, Simon? Hall manure. Can I get you to do that one instead? Try that again. There you go. Now you're going to get both of them. Um, so, is there more manure? Yeah, there's some over there. Hate to set up all these individual little haul orders, though. That could get pretty time-consuming. So, I don't know how long they're going to build up. They may de degrade after a little while. we got a couple more over here. Let's grab all of you guys and undo that. And send out... Paulette, why don't you go and haul that manure when you're done with whatever you're cooking at the moment? Okay. All right, well, that was a good discovery. Unpowered fridge. Yeah, that's going to be taken care of here in moments. Connor's coming back. We'll watch her build this. Otherwise, Carter, once you're done constructing and repairing, let's get you building roofs. So, tap those in, Kana. Oh, you're done just like that. And construction. That only bought you 20 experience points. Okay, I was hoping for more. But we are powered up. Now, I haven't really taken a good look at the electric system yet. What does this mean? We're making 50, we're consuming 18. I know we can choose which circuit we want everything on, and at the moment... They can all be on the same circuit. There's, there's not a conflict here. Later, you might want to separate circuits out, like your defensive circuit, your oh, your 
your um, what do you call it? crafting circuit, uh, smelting circuit, and then you can turn them on and off as you need to use that power elsewhere. If you have barely enough power to make things happen, you can kind of delegate a little bit that way, which is kind of nice. But we don't need to deal with that now. Everything is powered and running. Uh, when she moved that, did it? It it moved with all the supplies. Okay, so 156. We still have one more slot available for something to go in here. So do we not have any? We don't have any pumpkin pies. That's why there's none in there. Okay, and Paulette at the moment is cooking more of the uh, porridge. I wonder what the meal limit is. I wonder how many you can stack in there. Um, I wonder if we should up these a little bit. How quickly are we eating through them? We only have one veggie soup out over there. is 51%, so it's going to rot soon. Over here, where are the rest of the... Oh, the meals are all in here now. Which means they will last a lot longer because they're in the fridge. Okay. The couple of things that I was dealing with as far as meal quantities. One, I didn't want Paulette having to be stuck at the stove all the time because I was hoping she would be able to do some crafting. But also, I didn't want to get so many on the shelves that they couldn't eat through them in time before they rotted because they weren't refrigerated. So it probably is time to go ahead and give this a little bit of a boost. Let's go to eight on these guys. Yeah, coffees, we'll throw another 10 in there. We've got two stoves available now, which means she could get something boiling there while she's cooking over here. And so we could very likely get more of the, uh, yeah, I need to get Rita planting these, more of the, uh, the, the drinks in stock without it costing us so much time. Rita's harvesting like crazy. Edmund is gone. Kana is transporting bricks and keeping everything running over here. That was quite a noise I just heard. <laughs> Pankoth or something in the trees. Carter, you're kind of the star of the day. Let's get these built. So you've got all the repairs done except for this one. What was that last thing? We lost some more harvest somewhere. Exploration complete. Signal rocket. What do we get? As the balloon descended, I saw a little ways off a person desperately fighting a huge bug-like creature. Ooh. Shall we wait to see what happens? Let's see who wins this battle. Help them fight off the beast? Of course. Or leave them to their fate and come back? I don't think so. Come on. Go make it happen. Save them. Seeing both of us coming at it with all that we've got, the creature was wise enough to back off and scuttle into the bushes. Great job. Now we get... Now, now get back, both of you. How do you pronounce that name? Um, Umayar? Umair? Umair. I'm going to go with that. Correct me if I'm wrong. Joins. 18 happiness. Okay. All right. Umair is intellect and cooking Ooh, no interest though unfortunately cooking is just barely above crafting why did it say cooking that's interesting back over here construction and physical i must have missed something somewhere no it says intellect and cooking best at oh i'm uh, is that that's Carter somehow. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Get that straight. All right, intellect and cooking. That makes a much more sense. And really interested in combat. Okay, good. Um, okay, let's. We'll read all that a little bit later. Carter, you need to get this finished. They're on their way back. Get that one, that one, this one. And. Then, how are you doing? Can I get you? I can. Come straight up here and get roofs done. If I grab this one, waiting for other construction. You can't build the roofs until you finish these walls. Oh, that's frustrating. You can build this one. Nope, you can't. Okay. 
Then Carter, your next job is to take down trees and do it fast. So once you've done that, you're going to cut and you're going to cut four of those. We need logs in there. Um, Kana, you as well. What are you actually doing right now? You're transporting. We don't need the bricks at the moment. Come on out here and cut some trees. I need your assistance. Can I get in there? Right there. Let's get you to cut those two. And then kind of grab that one. Cut those four. Let's get that done. Paulette, you probably just got back. No, you're still collecting. So there were 60 total. So 20 in each pile. I see. So you're grabbing those. Rita is transporting hers. Great. So what is out here? See if I can see them all. Uh, if I... Bush fruit, 684? Am I missing something here? Umayar is unarmed. I'm seeing 30 and 90. There's a 30. 30, 30, 30. Yeah, I guess we do have that many. Wow. Okay. Um... These, wow, we got a lot of fruit. We need to, we need to come up with a use for those real quick. All right, you keep transporting, uh, Paulette. When you get back, we're gonna need you transporting. Yeah, Simon, what are you up to right now? You're researching what? You are spaceship uh, deconstruction. That I do want going, but can we? get berries in here should that be the next thing to go in it probably should the pumpkin pies they eat as fast as they find it and the, actually the dried meat i would think would already have a long shelf life that makes sense yeah let's say no dried meat here so is that a quick meal i would think that's an other meat soup tasty so is that a raw Meats. That's considered a raw. Okay, so no dried meat in here. Okay. And let's turn on the bush fruits. With that many of them, let's put a big clump of them in here to preserve them while we're, while we're hopefully using the other ones. Okay. So we'll make that happen. So, Simon, you... Mmm could be helping cutting as well you could simon come on over here and find a tree somewhere to cut so cut that one and then come on over here and cut these you can be cutting and simon can be building that much faster kana is cutting carter is cutting carter Come on over and build this wall as fast as you can. Uh, construct wooden floors. Yeah, come do that. So, Carter, you are right there. Grab the wood that's available. Are you going to walk over and find the other? No. So you get that going. And as soon as these guys start dropping trees, you can go and find more. Paulette is transporting manure to that shelf. There's still room and pause what did that do for us now we can craft ah craft slop we do need to get that in for the dog that i think would use far less meats uses 20 raw foods we can put that in the in the uh, food bin instead of our meats or our vegetables so let's keep 100 slop in stock at all times so that is something that needs to get done and probably needs to stay up there. So let's move you up quite a ways. Though temporarily we need to get another weapon for Uamar. You Uamar? Um Umayar? You're gonna have to help me with the trans with the the pronunciation there. I want to get that right. Um slop there. We do need another crossbow. I would say so. We've got four of the short bows in stock. Crossbow, one. And spear, one. 
and Kana did get a spear eventually, right? Did that ever happen? It did not. Apparently it never got made, because we never had any wood in stock. That's right. So now we have two spears waiting to get done. Let's send you to the top. As soon as there is wood available, that gets done. But beyond that, slop gets done. Now what I came here to do, and never got to it, where is the idea of making liquid fuel out of manure? Okay. Which tells me that we want to put two crafting tables together. Move you to here. And we're going to build another crafting table. That one for just maybe manure and leather. And the other one can be for all the individual items that we need crafted. Okay, so that's more of a bulk goods crafting table over there. Alright, I like that. So that takes care of the idea of manure. We're going to need a bed, which means we need to get it built now. Um, let's get this bed laid in here. And we'll decide who gets the privilege of using the first room. Though, I have a feeling they're going to be stacked three deep for a while until we get the rest of these rooms built. Yeah, pretty much. They're not going to be happy. Um, furniture, beds, and do we want to go with any other kind of bed? No leather, no leather. Oh, I see. That's just the base. So stone, we have 60. Right now we have plenty of wood. We better just stick with what we've got. Fabric, we have lots of fabric. Okay, so pop you into there. And Carter, let's set that up as an order for like almost immediately. Okay. Otherwise, I need you to... You're good for a while. Carter, I need you to continue working on these walls, floors... And then I need walls so I can get roofs. Yeah, well, we'll see. Maybe we can... Boy, there's nobody else that can help. There is nobody else. Um, manage, expedition... No, not expeditions. Back up, close. Manage, activities, construction. Yeah, Carter's the only one. And Edmund is not skilled enough to even help. Okay, Carter, you gotta make this happen. Boy, I got dark quick. 1800 hours. Carter is constructing floors, so he's going out to grab more wood. And can I, after Kana cuts this, get her to deliver wood? So let her finish. Simon is cutting over here. So Simon is transporting. Let's see what he does. Okay. So Kana, stop. I need you to transport specifically. Can I say transport to? I can only get construct. Can't do it. So all I can do is get you to make your best guess as to where to deliver that wood. I can't get you to... Is there any over here? No. I can't say specifically this. Fill up the work orders that I need to get the roof built tonight. Okay. Ah, we have Edmund. And we have Uimar. <laughs> okay, we're gonna call him Umi until I come up with a with a better way of saying it. Umi, who are you? You are not going to get any raw foods, and you're not gonna get any emergency meals, and you're not gonna get any moonshine. For now. Okay. And you are a private investigator. Ooh, that's why the intelligence is so high. While growing up, Umi often felt unsafe outside of the confines of his home and preoccupied himself with obsessing over every unknown in the known universe. Ultimately, this made him a very good private eye and very poor company. Now on the trail of a new lead for the only case he, is, he has never been able to solve, a case that has frustrated him for years, he is heading to the outer quadrants. And then he crash-landed here. Agrophobia. 
has increased manipulation efficiency and happiness while inside, which are oh, agoraphobia, not agro, okay, while, which are decreased outside. So manipulation and happiness are better inside of the house. So he needs to be exclusively, boy, it gets, the music gets loud when I'm on, when I'm paused, which is kind of frustrating. Well, he's probably not going to be doing much of anything. Well, he could. Okay. Let's set you right now. You are moving a soldering. No, you are handling a cook stove. Okay. Let's set you up immediately for research. Yeah. That's Kana. Go back. So um, let me see you one more time. Right there. Research and cooking. All inside jobs. That works out really well. And you right now, uh, right there, have got a negative 15 because you're outside and you'd rather be inside. So when you get inside, you must have like a positive 15 all the time. Okay. So manage activities. You are our lead researcher and a backup cook. Right there. So, you do not have any worthwhile healing skills. Handling everybody... Yeah, you'll be around, around so you can handle and deliver. You'll be around camp all the time. Constructing, you... Where are you? You're at the bottom now. So, you're going to be a five. Hunting, you'll be a five. Though you are interested, you don't like going outside to do it. Five. Harvest. Five. Um, doesn't say you're indifferent about anything, so I don't have to make you a zero. Cut. You won't be heading outside that much, so ranching is all off. Planting is off. Scavenging is probably off, but that frees up Simon and some others to go and do that with your doing all the research now. Mining. That is an off. You're capable of, so you're going to be primarily cooking. Crafting. You are a two. You're capable of it. We'll leave that as a three. So that means all three of these will be threes. And observing will be two. Nope, that's a five because that's outside. Okay, that's your setup. And let's quickly pop in your schedule and we'll match you to everybody else. There and anything to there and relax to there. There you go. Okay, you are set. You're going to handle a cook stove, so you're going to throw some uh, some twigs in there. Great. Rita is training. Good. And Carter, we need to make sure that bed got built, even though it's going to be outside tonight. Hopefully, that Carter, I think that's your bed. Yeah, that is your bed. You're constructing a floor. Let's let you put all this wood down. Once you do, I'm going to, I can just set you right now. Carter, there we go. When you're done... Go ahead and construct it. It's already in the queue. I won't disturb anything yet. Let's get everybody to drop their things down. Paulette is dropping the fabric in there. Great. So that's part of deliver. And she's set for deliver. Okay. That's all loaded up. So Carter, when you're done, you will definitely get to that. I know it's in the queue, but let's just make sure. And so that's going to become your bed. This bed is going to become Umi's for the night. Right there. Carter, you get the first bed since you went to the trouble of building everything. Carter, constructing floor. We have enough laid out here. We do, to get the roof on this section. So Carter, cancel everything. Build the bed. Wait for it. Okay, you really want to eat, I know. How are you doing? Ah, uh, you can go a little longer. You're going to construct the bed. Then you're going to construct these walls, uh, floors. Wooden floor reserved by Edmund. Ooh. Okay. Then, Carter, you build the bed. Then you come on over here and grab a Carter. Grab a... Why can't I... Okay, I gotta find the pumpkin pie. 
Are you in here? No. So just like that, and Simon got the pumpkin pie first. <laughs> I only see one. What you got in here? There's two. Where is the other pumpkin pie? He's going to Simon to the fridge. But it's not there. The stove. Carter, when you're done, you're going to cook reserved by Simon. Okay. I want to get this to Carter because I want him to work through the night. So you need the bonus. And where does it say? Eat buttermelon pie. Boom. Okay. Oh, that was hard. You're constructing, then you're going to eat, and then you're going to get back up here and construct. But... I want to wait till Edmund gets his work done. And I want... No, Connor cannot help. So Edmund somehow can now do it? Did I get that wrong? You were going to construct. What did I click on? Waiting for other... This is... Okay, let's just watch and wait him. He's constructing a floor. He really is. Did he somehow get to level 3? Edmund, you're right there. Now, how can you suddenly be able to do this? What am I not getting here? You can do it. Okay, it takes you a little longer, but you can do it. Alright, well in that case, get these built over here. I need these walls done. What was that thump? Unarmed. Yep. I guess at the moment you're researching, why don't you grab one of these until we get you the other one built. And Kana, you're eating and it is 2200 and you're actually in pretty good condition here. Your rest is a little low, but your happiness is way up there. Can I get you to, after you're done eating, to build a crossbow? Thank you. And we got that moved? We did. Let's get another one of these built. Copy right here. And that's right. I can't give orders specifically for this one as compared to that one. We found that out with the cook stoves. So I can't make this the manure bench, for instance. The fuel bench. Hmm. Okay. Now we did get the fuel going. Yep, that's going and that's going. Okay. So Edmund, how are you doing over here? You are building like crazy, and you're still not really building the ones I wanted you to. Okay, so, well, you are now. Carter, you are still eating. When you're done, please come and build these walls. Right there. The wall is reserved by Edmund. Okay, well, we got two people that can build buildings now. Good news. I don't understand what changed, unless there was an update while I was gone. Because he was level 2 before. And now he's constructing roofs. I don't get it. Maybe it's level 2.5 for building buildings. Hmm. <laughs> Umi compared to... Uh, co claim to be better at darts than Simon. Everybody thinks they're better at darts than Simon. Poor Simon. Yeah, these guys, tell ya, they don't really care for each other, do they? You're always competing. All right, so Carter's constructing a wall. I wish I could get uh, Kana to do that too. But I think we're going to have a roof over that bed tonight. I think we are. Researching, researching. So Simon, what can we have you do? And yeah, I'm doing a lot of pausing this episode, which means it's going to go kind of long. And that's fine. That's fine. In fact, I wanted to mention that you know, I'm... I only have so long to be making these episodes before work is going to get busy and I've got to get back to my next renovation project. So if I'm putting these out faster than you can watch them, don't worry about it. You can catch up later, but I'm going to go hard and fast on this and get a bunch of episodes out. And then I may go a month or two without putting anything out. So later you can binge watch and catch up. But uh, yeah, that's just the way it's going to have to be. Um, Simon... What if we were to get you to... Uh, you don't have any physical, though. I'm thinking scavenge. Scavenge. 
but that is a physical, and Simon is quite low, which means he's going to haul less, but I also wonder if that means he's going to find less. That makes sense. When you send them out on an expedition, the lower the physical, the less they bring back, but that's because that's all they could haul. But I wonder if that also affects how much they're able to find in order to haul it. I don't know. So are we wasting our scavenging jobs by having a two do it instead of a five? Hmm. We'll have to think about that. We'll let, um, I just noticed something. We'll let them both research for a little bit, but we, we're clean up here. There's nothing going on. There's nothing that we don't have enough resources to do. That's what that means. Wow. Rita's going to sleep. We still have a whole bunch of berries out there to bring in. So we've got to transport tomorrow. We've got all of this hay to bring in. It's still over here. Um, we didn't put any food out for our dog. And dog is being petted. Will anybody think about feeding on their own without being told to? I don't know. Paulette, if I were to right-click, feed is available. If I were to shift-click that, let's see if you take care of that. We'll do it manually until we've got some slop to start filling up that food uh, food bowl over there. All right, what's happening here? We've got Carter constructing. Edmund, you have vanished. Edmund, you're already asleep. You were walking off to go to sleep. You... You can pull off a little bit more here. Can you come over and build some more walls? Floors. Yes, you build floors. Carter is going to build what he can. I need this much built. Carter, you're going to continue building. Uh, sure, you build more wooden floors. And then we'll get you to build all of the roofs that you're capable. Right there is two roofs possible at this point so you build what you can we'll get Edmund to build some and then we'll give up at that point and we'll just see what happens I guess Carter your bed is here uh, change owner to Carter you get the first bed in the house but oh Carter builds the roof from the center of course so I build a roof anyway you get the first uh, bed out here unroofed. Well, you'll have a roof kind of over your own bed if you get that one built right now. Right? Takes a while. Edmund's given up. All right, it's two in the morning. Carter, once you build that one, I'll let you give up as well. There you are. Okay, go to bed. Now, you get a long walk in to get breakfast. That's one of the reasons why I was hesitant to get using this yet until we moved the kitchen over. Uh, insufficient fuel for refilling this guy. Yep. And that's fine. But there's the first uh, insufficient of anything that we've got. So Edmund's gone to sleep. Umi's sleeping over there next to Rita now. And a lot of booms. I'm guessing those random booms out there our meteors that are coming down. I think so. Um, we're ready for our next attack here. Is there anything? Nothing is listed as needing repairs. Okay, gates. Yep. So it's ready to go. And we got our our hungry stomach sounds over here. Yeah. There it is. That is such a weird sound. It's like it's like a built-in monster sound in here. You're just like, oh, do I want to go in there or not? Okay, who's up first? Uh, oops. Oops. Um, Kana, sorry. Why don't you go to sleep? Yeah. You, uh, you get some sleep. Yeah, I forgot about you. You, yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, so Rita, I... Got you distracted by sending you out here last time for grabbing all of those. I need you probably just to get back to working on these. Have these been vanishing on us, or did you get in here to do some of them? 
I don't know. But you need to be left alone to do some gardening. Okay. We are definitely in the fall. But now that Edmund can help build the house, we are going to be able to be in here. We're down to 32 degrees. That's freezing. It's time to get these guys... Yeah, we got to get them indoors. What am I hearing? Noise all over the place, like a lot of wind. So many birds and chirpings and wind blowing and leaves rustling. My experience of this game is probably different from you guys with all the, the speakers I've got in here. It's actually kind of cool. I, I'm, I'm inside the game. Okay, you are researching and your physical is what? Zero. So you're no good for scavenging either. Okay. I see our grasses are starting to turn uh, brown. Yeah. Definitely fall is coming in. Look at that. It's happening. We need to be making coats. We do. Connor, when you get up, I guess next year we're going to get you uh, skilled up for carpentry. Because you are too good at making things like coats. we got to get those done. Simon is researching and I need to rethink Simon. What else is there for Simon to do that is important? Um, we finally have enough wood out there for cutting. Cutting is physical. physical cutting also skills up the physical. Which could get you stronger, quicker. There is that. Though I could also have you doing a lot of the handling. So Kana could just stay on tailoring for a while. That seems important as well. Let's go that route for the immediate. In fact, let's just do it this way. Simon, let's make your handle a 1. And your research a 2. So you're going to deliver and handle like crazy. So that... Paulette can get done with the cooking and then concentrate in here and Kana can concentrate in here. So I don't know that I want to take these off of here because I think by making Simon a one he'll just get it all done before they get queued in to do it. Let's play with that. So Simon you are going to be Ah, uh, right there. You go find something that needs to be done. You are relaxing. Okay. So relaxing is the 7 o'clock hour or the 8 o'clock hour? 7 o'clock hour. All right. So we've got musical instruments being played. We've got researching. Let's pop you and get some... Get that going. Edmund is eating. You are going to do what? You're going to go play the digi the didgeridoo with Simon playing the handpan. Cool. And there's all the sounds. <laughs> okay. And we could get Kana and Edmund to both write. Oh, and they take that as their entertainment as well. Research spaceship. No, Kana. Why don't you write a short story, and Edmund, why don't you write a short story? You both do that. That'll put a bunch of short stories. Solar eclipse, but no impact. Because a solar eclipse only deals with something like a um, uh, solar panel. Whereas a solar flare deals with electrical. Okay, we have no solar panels at the moment. Yeah, okay. So anyway, the YouTube are going to put a bunch of stories up on the shelves. So we've got some argued with Simon about research practices. Oh, that's some creepy music. <laughs> Something ominous is happening. Oh, the solar eclipse is all going to get dark. And whatever comes out in the night will be coming out. Okay, wow, we got an even redder. So, Simon, you... Well, once you're done with... Simon, 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 Simon. You're eating. Once you're done with the eating, and you'll do some delivering in here. 
and some handling in here. I like some more bricks. Bricks are 29. We need bricks for repairs for whatever is coming up, but we don't necessarily have to have them right now. And you've got a fast run speed. Uh, right there. So immediately haul hay. Then... Here. There you are. Haul those guys and haul these guys. Okay. So researching, eating, deconstruction is done. Okay, so we'll set you for salvage again. Good. And somebody's playing with the dog. Rita is training. So what does the training do? Car Construction 7. Nice. Mm, training level 2. I wish there was a chart or something to let us know what that means. You're training level 2. So it was petted by. So you're, you're nice and happy. You're... I don't know if your food level is good or bad. Training experience. Your health is in good shape. And this is who you are. Unlocks. Taming of dogs if researched. And dog statue. So, yeah, I've got no idea what the taming does. Oh, well. If you guys have a clue, let me know. be nice if there was a chart or something that was connected to our... Our pooch. Kana is transporting. Okay. So, Kana, I need you... Well, yeah, go ahead and do that. That's kind of important. But after that, let's get you exclusively working on Kana. There we go. Working on the... Crossbow. That's Paulette. <laughs> Never mind. Um, I had you shift clicked, so I didn't interrupt anything. Oh, good. So I'm mixing up Paulette and Kana, and I'm mixing up Simon and Edmund. Yeah. There we go. Crossbow. Limit crossbow. There you are. And I do have Kana this time. Okay. You're going to do that one next. Perfect. And then I think it's time to get these spears done. Actually, some slop would be good. Yeah, we'll get that going. All right. That's you two. Carter is eating, Khan is transporting, Edmund is constructing the roof. That was my next thing. I wanted to get you in here and get these roofs built. So without that, we we can only do so many. Okay, so Edmund, next I want you to get these walls done. All right, you do that. Carter can do the roofs a lot faster. So let him do that. You just plow through these walls. And once that is done, I guess I can release this. In which order? We could stack one, two, three beds in each room. That's six of us. And another one or two in here to get by. Get this area built and get our kitchen going. I think so. Carbon nanotubes, I think they're just going to have to wait. Winter's coming. We need to get in here. We need to get this guy sealed up so we can turn on some heat and get everything warmed up. In fact, if we could do that today. Let's plan on doing that today. Everybody, you're moving. Move the beds in. There. And then one more bed right there. You guys are all going to be in this building today. Move and... I guess just kind of tucked into the corner right there. Okay. So, Edmund, we need this. That's a wall. So, that's not part of this. Okay. Edmund is constructing the roof. Edmund, can you please... Oh, you're still working on that. Same one. Okay. Now you're going to work on the walls. All right. Carter, what you up to? You are getting back to work on the roofs. Perfect. So, other people like Kana could be moving the beds. Transporting... Draft, undraft, idle. Somehow, I messed it up again when I told you... No, to build the crossbow. 
Did you finish your crossbow? What is this? Unfinished crossbow. Can you... Can I get you to finish the unfinished crossbow? Currently unavailable craft crossbow. So you still have to get new building materials to start a new crossbow, and I don't know how to get her to finish the previous one. Especially since she was the one that was working on it, right? Paulette, I can't get you to do it, can I? Apparently I can. It must have been Paulette I had doing that last night instead. Okay, we'll shift-click you, and you work on that, cr that crossbow. So, Kana, you instead could move all of these beds. You need some rest. You stayed up late last night. But you can certainly get some of these beds moved. Uh, am I missing something? Currently unavailable. Because I... There we go. You're still trying to transport. Kana gets you to move bed. Oh, and you're going to do all three of those? All five of them? No. Well, I'm not sure how many. But I will queue up more of them. A four in queue. So let's move that one. And move. I guess that's... It's a whole bunch of them. Somehow five are queued up and there are six. But I don't know. We'll figure that last one out at the last moment. Okay, so you are moving them. Good. Construction three for Edmund. All right. So maybe Kana can give us a hand working on the second half of this and get her skilled up for that. Uh, Paulette is... It says you're grabbing all these to do it, but in reality you're just grabbing the unfinished one. Okay, so that must have been you doing it instead. No, it wasn't. Because Kana's the one that didn't get any sleep. I am a little confused there. Yep. Okay. You are lacking fuel, so we have not finished these yet. Um, so we moved all this. It's awkward looking, but soon we're going to be living in here with all that anyway, so that's fine. Um, let's copy and put a couple more of these in. I guess I can't stack them right there. Let's just put one more in. And we'll get three rounds of fermentation going at once. Okay. So more fuel happening. Um, there's that noise. Wong. Edmund reached. Research that. Solar eclipse. And fuel. Edmund is cutting. So you're not. Okay. You're still kind of set to do lots of different things. There's no more construction projects to do. Ooh, so mm, I can't get you to just do one bed. That is so annoying. Edmund, maybe if I actually had you selected. Reserve by. There's six beds. But I, I can't. Hmm, okay. I can't get him to help. He will cancel all of Kana's orders. Yeah. Okay. So will Doggy go back to bed on his own, or is he stuck out here? I don't get what's happening there. I have to try to remember to take a look at him at night. Kind of disappointed in the dog mechanic. I really would like to see the dog roam our whole encampment. You know, patrolling, guarding, curious, sniffing, what have you. Simon, you're actually in great shape still let's have you continue this job so when you're done come back out and haul more of these and because there's still a bunch of them out here 215 oh that means you can get the rest of them this time okay manure wise we have just the 20 I think we had a lot more of them up here and how many of the the hay is still up here Ah, uh, probably better to do it this way. 
40 hay and 60 manure. Let's go there and use. And we'll that. So they automatically come forbidden to keep them from just wandering off all over the map looking for poo. So we'll unforbid those. There's 60 of them in one area. That's that's worth the trip. Okay, Carter is transporting. Why? Because there's nothing more to build. Okay. Let's open up our refrigerator and get that built. I think so. So we're going to go from here. Let's see if I get that guy straight with my window. If I grab kind of all of that and add that. There. Construct. That should turn all that back on. Yeah. Let's get this group working on. Then we'll start queuing up all the rest of it. But that, we still have enough wood to handle that. Oh, good. Though we're, now we're going to need a lot more bricks. So, time to get the handling done over here and get that going. Paulette is crafting Umi's crossbow. Carter is transporting because he, now he's got the orders to go build something. Edmund is constructing a floor. He's going to grab any wood that's left over here. We lost harvest. Oh, that was a bad harvest to lose. Read what you're doing. You are harvesting. There must have been a plant still triggered. And there's nothing more to carry? Yes, there is. So, Rita, how about you? Simon. Oh, you're just arriving. There's some that... No, he was going to be able to get it all. He's got 45. And there's... Yeah. He should be able to get exactly 240 out of that. Okay. Watching that all tick off. There's a storm coming in. Something's coming in. A lot of wind. 215. There's 25 left. And he's got it. 240. Okay. Is that rain coming in? Just a lot of sounds. Oh. You guys are new. Ah, we've had something. We've had another spawn in of animals into the game. Yeah. Looking for our, our our big chicken friends. Don't see any of those. Uh, what was that? We lost some more harvest. So Rita, unfortunately... Yeah. That was a painful loss. Looks like we, we lost everything in this field here. And I don't know if we're going to be able to plant anymore. Hmm. Okay. So Rita, you're hauling in... And you're pretty much done for the day. You could go a little bit longer, though. So let's get you to harvest these guys next. And I guess harvest these while they're still available. Yeah. Uh, plant. Fertilize. Okay. Oh, this is a cut job. Anybody can do that. Simon, when you're done, you get in here and start cutting. Okay, and Kana, you are constructing something? What are you constructing? Oh, you can... No, what are you constructing? Did I accidentally build instead of move? Oh, moving is considered constructing. Oh, you're still working on those. I see. Okay, okay, okay. That makes sense. So Edmund is constructing floor. Boy, I wish I could get him to help Kana move beds. Too bad it groups everything like that. Hmm. So get rid of you. And Carter is... He brought a whole bunch of logs over to deal with floors. But he's all stressed out now. Kana's moving a wooden bed. Boy, I wish I could get someone else to help you. Rita is transporting. So Rita, when you're done... You're going to harvest, and that is it on the harvesting. That's queued up, at least. Yeah. Edmund is helping construct. Umi is researching what now? Concrete rooms. Research. Veggie armor, oil extraction. What else has popped in that's really important? What was that thump? Something just got built. Okay, that takes a lot of time. Um, first aid kits, we're still sitting pretty good on those. 
Insect facts and oil extraction. That was a real quick one. Six hours. Any of the six hour ones I can just toss in? No, but there's a lot of 12 hour ones. Don't need the pacifier right now. Could just get this guy as an option and get it in there. Incendiary traps. Let's throw this in as an option. Flare shielding, no. Um, all right, we'll just we'll think about that. Uh, Paulette is cooking. Foods are looking pretty good. Freezer is looking like what? A lot in the freezer. Good, a lot of meals in there. Unpowered devices too. What do you suppose that's all about? You are out of fuel. Oh. Okay. So we need to stay ahead of our fuel, which is going to take a little while. If I were to set into motion an order for liquid manure. Didn't I already do that and set it for 100? I set the slot for 100. Let's set you... So what does this mean? 40 manure. It takes 40. Doesn't tell me what I'm going to get out of that. So let's just have you do it 10 times then and we'll figure that out. And who is to do that? Rita? I mean, uh, Paulette. We are... You haven't started something. Okay. Can you immediately come over here and give me some fuel? Let's make that happen. And for that matter, Khan is busy though. Kana, you're at this point here. Let's have you make me some fuel as well. And Edmund, you, Carter, who can be transporting and doing beds? Hmm. Who has the faster walk speed? Simon does. You are cutting right now. Can you quickly move the beds? Yeah, you're going to move three beds. You'll get them done faster. You're not going to gain from it, but i that's why we would realize that that doesn't gain your construction skills anyway. Okay, Carter's going to eat. And we now have leather. Okay, so that has completed. We have 30 leather, which allows us to put up a punching bag. Well, there's a lot of... Ooh... We are doing some serious chemistry over here. Yeah. Um, punching bag would probably land right in this area somewhere. Okay. Let's go ahead and make that happen. Punching bag is here. There is no place to approach it from. Okay. In that case, let's put it right over here. We are out of logs, though. Out of wood. Which popped that in. Okay. And that's just a cut order, and we'll handle that in a little bit. In fact, I guess I could, between episodes, find more trees that are already maxed out. Okay, so how long have I been recording? Too long. Okay, so are we getting close to being done here? I think we are. Yeah, we'll hang around long enough to see what happens here. So beds are going to get done. I've got to assign beds up there. I have to figure that out. But let's speed you guys up and see how much fuel you're going to make. So this one, Paulette just finished 10. So she's making 10 at a time. So Kana made the other 10. And you are both taking it over to the generator. Nice. That is actually really nice. I could see Kana not being able to because Paulette had it already taken up. But we are able to function good. So with that, I think we're going to call this one done. We got a lot done, and I don't know, we probably have a bug attack coming next episode. But we've moved in. Enough to where, yeah, there is a sense of completion going on. I don't have any windows. I don't. Yeah, it's kind of ugly at the moment. But I think you got to close the windows for winter anyway. Maybe wait till spring and cut those windows in. Yeah. 
Anyway, I'll catch you guys later, folks. Bye-bye.